Welcome everyone, I'm Crystal Shalee, your host for Popcorn Picks, as we preview what's playing in theaters this week. Grab a bag of popcorn, a drink, and I have a seat for you as we watch what's playing. So sit back and relax and enjoy the show. I hate flying. The lines, the crowds, the delays. I always kind of liked it. Six hours, one seat, nobody can get to you. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome aboard our non-stop service from New York to London. You fly much? All the time, actually. flight is threatening to kill someone every 20 minutes unless 150 million dollars is transferred to this account number we're midway across the atlantic how do you kill someone in a crowded plane and get away with it ladies and gentlemen i need every passenger to raise their hands above their head this is a bad idea we have a right to know what the hell is going on. Agent Marks, the account number you gave us is in your name. What? That doesn't make any sense. This is a setup. Something else is going on. The FBI, the White House, and Interpol are confirming reports that an international flight has been hijacked by an air marshal. Major Marks, our fighter escort has you in their sight. Do you hear me? We're running out of time. Do you hear me? I'm not hijacking this plane. I'm trying to save it. Do you need help? There's nothing to help with. What are you doing? Going fishing. I'm telling you, there's no fish out there. How did this happen? Come with me. What are we gonna do? Change the world. Our sins are forgiven, my son. I thought only God could do that. Which is easier, to say his sins are forgiven, or say he get up and walk? I've had reports of a young prophet of Nazareth. It's rumored he works miracles. They all do. Blessed are the pure in heart, for they shall see God. Pray to him, and he will listen. 5,000 came to see him. 5,000. If you hunger for righteousness, will be filled through me. Who knows what pilot will do if the crowds run out of control? That man, Judas, he wants to help us. I will crush any rebellion. Save us from the Romans, Lord! There is something unusual about him. We must arrest this false prophet. But what if he is who they say he is? Won't somebody tell me? Peter, come. Answer if you can. One of you here will betray me to my enemies. I want someone to tell me what is the soul of a man. Jesus of Nazareth, you are charged with blasphemy. He has employed demons to heal. He threatened to destroy the temple. Tell us, are you the son of God? I am. Coming soon. 
Jim, what is this? Well, it's Dad's old camera. Nice, I gotta work in again. Check it out. That's my seventh birthday. Whoa, did you see that? What? I just saw something weird. You guys, you gotta see this. There's this footage of me at my seventh birthday. We were all at your seventh yeah. birthday. Just watch this. Right there. Look in the mirror. That's me. That is my t-shirt. That is my backpack. This is definitely me. It doesn't make sense. You hear that? Yeah. It's in my dad's old workshop. It's like a clicking or something. No <laughs> what the hell is that? This is some sort of a machine. Here we go, Project Almanac. That's something my dad was working on. Temporal relocation prototype? What does that mean? It means time travel. What? We should try to build it. We can't build a time machine. I mean, did you see the tape at your seventh birthday? I mean, I think we already did build it. You guys see this? <laughs> Shouldn't the next step be testing it on us? All right. You guys ready for this? Yeah. yeah. Why are we going in your house? Watch this, watch this. That's me sleeping. <laughs> we did it! It's yesterday! It's yesterday! We invented time travel! It's like a second chance machine. Well, let's take this thing out for a spin. I just failed my chem report. What's well, the classification of silicon? Silicon? Are you kidding? And I don't want to repeat 12th grade. I'm gonna groundhog dig this bitch. Follow me! Carbon, nitrogen, oxygen. Boom, Lou! That's just happened! I love time travel. Check it out before the world ends. I have to win the lottery. Welcome to Maserati. Before the world ends, I have to fall in love. David, are you seeing this? None of this happened before. Whatever we did, it had some crazy ripple effects. We have to go back and make it so that we never jumped in the first place. We cannot do that, okay? We it's gonna to. undo it's everything. I'm gonna go back and fix everything. Things are spiraling out of control. Oh my God. Did you ever think that it was dangerous? How do I know that this hasn't already happened before? Just keep thinking I can go back and I can fix it myself. David, stop! I have to figure out how to make it go back even further. It could kill you, David. Join us next week for another episode of Popcorn Picks.